everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am starting the Pikachu today and I am so, so, so excited about it. It is a square drill, it's a 30 by 40 and I am just so excited that let's just get started. I have three drills out right now set up of the colors. I have, see if I can get it, sorry, it is so zoomed in. Let's see if I can do this, sorry guys. Where, there we go. So I have 904, which is the uh, arrow to the side. I'm doing the upside down T, which is this one right here, 905. Really sorry, the light is gonna be coming in and out because it's just bad. And then this one is 890, which is another arrow. Some of the symbols in this are way too similar. I'll do that later when I'm not zoomed in as much. Maybe in a different video when I start reviewing it. But it's still, it's just it's really, really pretty. Though I think what I'm going to do is start with the uh, pound signs, which would be 809. And just get those out of the way. Oh my gosh, I have not done squares in a while. Guys, please forgive me while I start this over again and try to get everything nice and straight. That is not straight. Oh, it's already bothering me. And I am so sorry if the light goes in and out. It is a little overcast outside. Oh, that is a pretty color. So see, that's the color. It's just pretty nice. See, like I said, the light is going to go in and out. I'm really sorry. And I'm also using my um, inside camera because I wanted to make sure that everything was in focus correctly. Um, and I'm, okay, I'm going to do 704, which is the little A, which is a yellowy green. That's actually not too bad of a color. I wanted to make sure that I could see what you guys were seeing so that I wasn't totally off the screen or anything like that. Now this is going to take me a lot longer than my peacock. I am not going to be speeding through it because it needs to be perfect for my little boy that I'm making it for. So see, I don't know if you can see the difference. It's a little uh, darker. This one's a little bit more neon colored. They're both pretty. And we'll be doing a whole lot of greens. Uh, if you look at my unboxing, you can see what the Pikachu actually looks like. I forgot to bring the picture upstairs with me today. So I'll bring it next time. But yeah, so what's been going on at our place is my daughter has the flu, which is not fun. She is four, almost five, so she's able to tell us when things are wrong, but she's still just so itty bitty tiny. It breaks my heart. She came into my room yesterday morning sobbing, saying her eye hurt, her eye hurt, her eye hurt, which of course made me lose my mind. I had to call my mom, who is a pediatric nurse practitioner and has been for, you know, well over 20 years. Can you see that one up there? Does it go up that high? I think so. Okay. I'm trying to get the range of where everything goes. Okay, and then, so I did the pound. I don't think there's any more. Okay, so let's start with, hmm, let me start with this one. So this is T, or the upside down T, and it is 9.05, and the light is just not great. I am so sorry. I wish I could get it to be more of what it is. It is not that dark and it is more of like a true, true green. Now, if you have watched my other drill with me, you know that I am a huge fan of multi-placements. However, I'm going to get myself used to this these square drills before I start pumping out those because I need this to look amazing because it is for my little boy. 
And he loves, 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 loves Pokemon. Well, he loves his older cousins, and she is absolutely obsessed with Pokemon. Um, if you go to my Instagram page, which is RainbowCrafters33, you can see a picture of the Mewtwo I made for her. It is absolutely beautiful. It turned out so nice. Um, there were a little bit of qualms. The shipping was not amazing on it, so it got a big crinkle in it that I framed it so it's not as bad, but you know it did the crease to it. Um, I ended up getting a partial refund. Okay, well, let me see. Let me be adventurous. Are these four? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see. Are those straight? Yours look pretty straight. Goodness. Do you like how I don't even follow the own things that I say? See? Already messing it up. This one is not too bad. About redoing with my tweezers. Um, but. Oh my gosh, the one I'm doing, that peacock one, it drives me nuts. I have dropped um, some of the drills on it by accident, so it was really nice being able to very easily um, take them back off. But other than that, I mean, it just is such a pain in the booty to try and get that all on there. Okay, goodness me, like, come on, why don't you guys go down? Okay, so why don't we start with some of the side arrows in the circle. What is this color? Eh, I'm trying not to block it, see if I can get into focus. Once again, way too dark on the camera, for me at least. And this is 904 again. A really pretty color, 904. Eh. I'm sorry guys, I'm so bad at this, especially the super, super zoomed in look. So that is pretty, you can see it's a lot darker than what was the other one. The other one was 905, even though, oh gosh, only one off. That's this is um this is 904 and this is 905. That is a big difference. I'm sorry if my throat sounds a little scratchy. I hopefully do not have the flu, but my husband and I have just caught something else. So nice and raspy. Though I don't know, maybe some people find my high pitched voice to be a little too much. I don't know. If so, then this is probably preferable. <laughs> Oh, but this is so nice. This canvas is so well colored. The Mewtwo one, once again, like I said, I it was very, it turned out beautiful, but it was kind of a pain. I'll have to, if I can figure out how to put pictures on top of the video, I'll post one, but no promises because I've barely found out how to add text and if you look at my video that I posted yesterday it's my speed paint or speed paint <laughs> it's my speed drill of my peacock's body that's um, I put a little bit of text on it which is super cool and I added music to it I just felt like I was on top of the world there figuring out how to find Free programs that I don't have to pay for that work on my Chromebook. I do not have a laptop and my computer is a thousand years old. So I use my handy dandy old falling apart Chromebook when I don't want to use my laptop or when I don't want to use my actual computer or my actual computer won't load stuff like I don't think video is something that it is gonna be able to do it is so old it's older than my children are oh man okay so then let's go to the little end with the Google on the end of it so that is so that is 
809. And it looks like this. It's another dark. This is the darkest of the ones that I'm using today. So here, let me show you. Oh gosh, no, that's not the same. Oh, okay. So that is 904, 905, and then 890. See, it's very dark. Oh, it's a pretty, pretty color, though. I bet it is not going to show up nearly as nice. Yeah, but then it's all fuzzy. Oh, I will have to use my back, my actual camera for the next one. I apologize. I am trying to make these look as nice as possible. I mean, I'm not going for anything professional or anything like that, but you know, I want them to look nice so that people enjoy watching them and, you know, it looks like I put some effort into it. I didn't just record it because actually I'm not just recording. Like, I would like to put up stuff that looks nice. Um, yeah, and like I said, if you want to see progresses of my other stuff or what else I've done, my Instagram is where to go. And I post a couple times a day. At least I try to, and it's kind of funny because I'm a little quirky. <laughs> okay, so we've got a three. I want to try again, see if I can make this work. So, I push them together, lightly put down. That looks pretty pretty well lined up, not completely. It's a little better. Okay, oh goodness, hopefully my head's not in the way as I try and switch the back well. Oh, I think I did a good job. Yay! I did it, guys! Woohoo! It looks great! Yay! Oh, man. And then, let's see down there. Gosh, see, some of these are just sideways. <laughs> let me see, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get cocky here. Try something. Whoa, oh, go back. Ah. Let me see if I can do four. Try and line them up. This is the problem with the circles. You don't have to do any of this. You just kind of go for it. Let's see, there's a little bit of space, but I think it'll be okay. Give this a try. Sorry if my head's in the way again, guys. I need to be able to see. Yay! Oh boy! I, I'm 99%. No, I shouldn't say that. That's a total lie. I am 75% sure that I will not be using my nine, uh, my nine drill placer, because that is just way too many, <laughs> and I really don't want to mess this up. Let's see if I can get this one. Well, it's not lined up against anything else. That looks... Ooh, awesome! Oh, okay, I so know. yay, I guess I can do this. Oh, that makes me so happy. I love, 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 love multi-drilling. Oh, it's gonna be way too far down. So, yeah, sorry, I don't have much to talk about today. I am a little boring. I'm a stay-at-home mom with two little children, my first grader and a preschooler, and I can't believe my little princess is going to kindergarten next year. That totally blows my mind. When my son went, it didn't bother me as much, and I think a lot of that had to do with the fact that his little sister was still at home with me. So it wasn't, you know, like, oh, all my kids are going to school. Ah, oh, freak out. This time with her going, I mean, I'll come home from dropping them off. I drop them off pretty early. I mean, for me, early. And then, oh my gosh, I won't know what to do with myself. I mean, she goes to preschool. But not for a super long period of time or anything like that. Let's see if I can get it. Those were way too far. I will say, I have not gotten, I've gotten one, um, on, no, on this one, let me see, is it still on here? Yes, it is. So, I, I don't know if you can see that. Eh. It's not going to go on focus. You're not going to be able to see it, but it's got a little dot on it. The little dot of, there's something wrong with me. <laughs> okay. Let's see if I can do a sideways one. You like how I'm a total liar? I'm not gonna do this at all on mine. <laughs> I 
um, if you have any suggestions of things you'd like me to talk about, things you'd like me to mm -hmm. show you, or you just want to give me suggestions or say hi, said I'm a stay-at-home mom. I'm just, you know, I'm always looking for people to talk to that have similar hobbies because none of my friends have any interest in doing this sort of thing, which is fine. They don't have to. It would just, you know, be nice to meet some people that do. So, yeah. And it looks like I am out of my squiggles. So, let's see. Some more of these ones. Let's see. Let me try. Try my luck here. See how this goes. Let's see a little off. This is one that I hate when you get yes. wax on it. It's so yes. annoying. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So 16 minutes in, we'll get it to 20 minutes and then call it. Uh, yeah, so like I said in my last video, and I think I said it earlier, my daughter is sick. She has the flu, so we've just been hanging around for the last two days. Putzing around, not doing much of anything. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my upside down tea. I know it has an actual name, but I have no idea what it is. Um, and I've just been kind of bored, so I'm pretty sure I'll have a lot of content to share. Oh no! Actually, oh how lucky that one matches, but this stuff is too sticky. Unlike my last one, which was not sticky. Well, like the other one I'm working on, my peacock. Oh, it's the bane of my existence. I can hardly do multi-drill because it won't stick. It just comes right back off because the adhesive of the wax to the pen is apparently as strong or stronger than the adhesive on the actual canvas, which is not cool. And I mean, the, the problem with this one is... Oh, look at that cute little star. Which one is that cute little star? Oh! This cute little star is this one. It's 701. It's just another nice lightish green. Let's see. Let's put these on. Where did it go? There's a cute little star. And there's two cute little stars. So I'm going to try and do this section by section. Oh, I don't know if you can see. Got the little dot on it. And I'm sorry if you can hear my son in the background. He is very loud. <laughs> he can't help himself. He takes after me. I'm a pretty loud person myself. So, um, I'll grab some before I finish this video. Let me just put these two down. Oh, there's a lot of stars. I could have gotten it out in my actual tray. Okay. And go back into place. Okay. So... Derek, you are being, Derek, Derek, you are being very loud. Thank you, buddy. So, some of the ones, let me zoom out for you. You know, like this, I use my mom's picture, my placeholder. Super, super, super cute. And actually, here, let me back you guys up a little bit. And I can show you what it actually looks like. Ooh, that could have been bad. Oops. So here is what Pikachu actually looks like. You see how nice it is? Because the colors are all actually different along with the symbols. However, hmm, some of these symbols are not my favorite because they are way too close to each other. Okay, so this one right here is 977. It is a little cross. 154 is also a cross. They are both crosses. This one, I had to go back. It's supposed to be a very big uh, vertical and then a very thin horizontal. But they are very, very similar. Not cool. And then there is also 912. Which is the opposite. 
912, where it's very thin vertical and a thicker horizontal. That is craziness to me. And then I have two arrows. We have the 906 arrow. And then we have the 745 arrow. Look at those next to each other. No, are they different? They're totally different, but you know. Sorry, you cannot see this well. But this one is thicker and it has a line around it and this one's just like this. But, oh my goodness, those are way too close. That drives me absolutely insane. The only plus is they are very different colors. Let's see, are there any others that are pretty close? I don't think so. I think that was about it as far as things that are like right on top of each other close. Okay, so I'm gonna stop this here. I'm sorry. <laughs> And I hope you guys all have a wonderful day, and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye!